Finally tonight, the computer designed to change the world. For years, a group of scientists in Cambridge, Massachusetts has been trying to develop a $100 laptop, cheap enough to get them in the hands of poor children around the world. Next month, the computer goes into mass production, and as ABC's John Berman reports, children in this country can contribute to their worldwide distribution. This is a YouTube video of a cow giving birth, filmed by a 10-year-old girl in a remote corner of Uruguay using only her laptop computer. It was a pipe dream in the beginning, and it now actually exists, and that's really pretty cool. The green plastic XO computer created by MIT professor Nicholas Negroponte is designed to withstand searing heat, freezing cold, and the harsh conditions of far-flung villages. It can be charged with a solar panel or hand crank. It's really the first time that anybody has built a machine specifically for poor kids in quantity. It has no hard drive or the ability to run Windows, but it does have the Internet. The goal? Promote learning. For every single child in the world to have the opportunity to learn. But the costs of the laptop have been higher than expected, and the orders slower than expected. So today, they're launching a promotion called Give One, Get One. For $400, Americans can buy an XO, plus pay for one to be sent overseas. The big question is, will kids in the U.S. used to high-speed, high-power computers buy into the notion of these small plastic devices? The answer, at least according to this small focus group, seems to be yes. It's great. It's too great. I want to keep this. The kids seem to love the games, the interaction, and the camera. That's a good one. See, I do have more teeth than you. Is it about fun? When you have fun doing things, you learn a great deal more. Learning here, and Nicholas Negroponte hopes, learning everywhere. John Berman, ABC News, Cambridge, Massachusetts. What a great last picture. And that is World News for this Monday. I'm Charlie Gibson, and I hope you had a good day.